crazy. Yeah, I think the people in Guyana is really definitely cricket crazy. The thunderous roar you get from the people that when you're going out to bat, yeah, yeah, definitely cricket crazy. The atmosphere is unbelievable. It's a lot of noise all around. You have the mongo over there, the people just, just go crazy, they enjoy the cricket, they're so passionate about it. People coming down long ago, like three o'clock in the morning to just be at the gates, just to get into the ground. Now that the T20s are playing, the people, are, you know, they're pouring from all direction, coming and they're still crazy about the game. People in Guyana is easy going, um, everybody's friendly, they're welcome, they're very welcoming. It's very busy, you get in the Georgetown, all the things you can do around there. Everybody comes you know, from everywhere up the country just to get to Georgetown, get the business done, get whatever they need to get done, and then head back home. So it's always been. My first memory of cricket was following my, my dad and my uncle, going to one village, to the next village, playing against each other. The rivalry between these villages normally is really, really overwhelming, exciting, and everybody used to come out and support it. I always go as a little boy in the team, and then one day, the, you know, the team was short. I had to step in, I was probably about seven or eight, and going out to bat. It was really excited, a bit nervy too, a bit scared, but got over it, and the experience was a big boost for me. Well, we had all the names from the past, like Rohan Kanai, Basil Bocho, Alvin Kalicharan, also from my club, and I, you know, you hear car hoopers and things, so you hear these guys and you follow them from youth cricket because Carl was just a few years ahead and he was playing youth cricket, so I was able to just track him down a little bit and watch him a bit also. Women cricket has come a long way. There's so much franchise cricket playing for the women. The level of cricket they're playing is amazing. They're all very competitive. They're all going to go out there and play hard. And because of that, it makes the competition so much more exciting because at any given day, any team will win. That's the thing, amazing thing about the T20 cricket and this World Cup here. Here in the Caribbean, you have to see them. Here in Guyana, you have to see them. And what quality cricket they're going to give you. Zatin from our team, she thumped some balls. I saw her thump some in St. Lucia, up in the stands also. I'm thinking that there's no need to bring the boundary in for them. They're hitting it in the stands. You know? so, you have the home crowd behind you. That is what you want. You want the support. You want the people behind you. Amazing things happen when you have your people behind you supporting you. Believe in your team. Believe in everyone else. And relax and play the cricket.